Hey, we're back. And folks, how many times have you gone to go hook up to a boat trailer or any other type of trailer and you find out you don't have the right size ball? Or in other words, you may have to have a whole bunch of different trailer balls in order to do what you want to do. We got a solution for that. I got Joel Helmuth here from Genie Hitch. And Joel, you brought a nice hitch here with you that's very versatile. Tell me a little bit more about it. Well, Dave, with our hitch, uh, we've, we've combined a bunch of different hitches. We put them all into one, one nice compact unit. Mm -hmm. uh, by literally pulling a pin, you can change the height and the size of your ball. Not only have we done that, we've also incorporated a, a very nice pinnel attachment. Okay. Now, for, for those of you that, that don't know what a pinnel trailer is, it's actually uh, like your army trailers and a lot of your heavy duty uh, construction trailers are gonna have a ring on them. Mm -hmm. A big heavy ring that'll slide over here. This will slide out across, lock that in place. Okay, so that's gonna make it a lot easier for you guys out there, especially if you run into that. You don't run into that a lot, but there are certain trailers that do have that. But you got your other size balls on here. What do you got here? Uh, we got the two and five sixteenths, two inch, inch and seven eighths, the three uh, most common ball sizes on the market right now. Okay, and of course you can see that we have this mounted down here on our truck and we got our boat trailer hooked to it. Now you can see the tongue here is nice and straight and level and that's great because you don't have to be pulling up or pulling down like so and you can adjust this right here. Show us how you do that. It literally uh, just, just pulling a pin, you can just adjust your height and also, the nice thing about this, as you can see, this one's actually, we've got this in a, in a rise position. So if your truck's sitting too low, you can get a rise out of it. Down here, what we have is we've got it in a drop position. Okay. So now, you can, you can get your drop out. If, if you have a lifted truck or the truck's sitting too high, it'll, it'll adapt to any, any trailer you have. Yeah, a lot of guys do have their trucks lifted. they got bigger wheels on oh, there, yeah. and it raises it up. And so that can create a problem. Now, also, Let's say you've got this hitch on here, but you've got other accessories, or you know, somebody wants to carry like a bike rack or something. Tell me how that works. Well, uh, this thing adapts to any two inch uh, attachment on the market. So literally, you can take these attachment out. You can put a slide a bike rack in here, uh, cargo racks. We have a lot of uh, people in the RV industry that will actually use this as a dual application, mm -hmm. where they'll put a bike rack on top, uh, maybe tow bars on the bottom. So they're able to take their bikes with them and still tow their, uh, their Jeep or their small car with them so they can go where they want to go whenever they want to go. Boy, that makes it a lot more handy. Certainly this is a lot more versatile. And it's, it's heavy duty. It's powder coated as you can see right here so you don't have to worry about it rusting or anything like that. What about general maintenance or care that you do with these things? You know, I see a lot of guys have you know, their trailer hitches out there, they got the, the trailer balls on there, they're all rusted and all that. What do you do for maintenance on these? Uh, well, this is, this is basically uh, made out of receiver tubes, so the, the main hitch itself doesn't need any maintenance at all. Mm -hmm. uh, we recommend that you keep your, your ball lightly greased uh, so that your trailer swivels on there nice and uh, keeps it rust free. Okay, Joel, now what's the weight capacity of this hitch? Well, in, in the two-inch models, we do a 10,000-pound and a 16,000-pound. Uh, the 16K is uh, better than any of the uh, any other adjustable hitch you'll find on the market. Now, in the two-and-a-half-inch, what we've got featured on this nice Dodge here is we can get a 21,000-pound uh, capacity out of that hitch. How about security? Now, you can also get security locks on these things too, right? Yes, we actually have our own our own uh, locking pin. Uh, they're actually, they look like this pin, but the other end is actually a keyed lock. So. so once you slide that in, then you can lock it. You don't have to worry about somebody who decides they like that hitch better than you do and walking off with it. Anyway, Joel, thank you so much for bringing this by. You got a real nice product here, and I can tell you this is going to be very versatile for you guys out there.